Alright guys, here's a little uh, stove test I'm conducting. Uh, this front blue one may look familiar. This is the uh, heavy duty Buzz Budweiser can I made, the side burner. Um, little Altoid Sky, very similar to the other one I used to have in my pack. I made this one that's sort of just like a candle. It's got fiberglass in there with the uh, little screen in there. But uh, some people have been using it for stoves and that one just bloomed up here. Uh, each of these stoves has 10 milliliters of alcohol. Now this one in the back, I'm going to do a separate review. This is a stove that came with the uh, Trill Design uh, Keg Caldera system. Um, I'm just doing sort of a quick little burn test here just to see where they're at. And you can see that Trail Design's got a nice tall blue flame. A uh, little Budweiser here is a little bit less, but it's made to be a side burner almost reaches the same height and then a uh, little Altoid guy and uh, we're just going to run a time test to see which uh, burns the longest um, everything looks like that but these all got uh, 10 milliliters measured with a syringe um, just for a strict see how long 10 millimeters 10 milliliters will burn um, the quickest to burn out but seemed to have the hottest flame uh, was the Budweiser at 3 minutes 45 seconds Caldera was right behind it at 354 and then you get a pretty good gap almost twice as much uh, next would be the tea light with 10 milliliters was 8 minutes worth of burn time uh, the little baby Altoids was 9 minutes and then the Etzbitz was about 12 they advertised 12 to 15 I don't think ever got any of them off for past 12 um, now for the boils, I upped it a little bit, um, simply because I wanted to measure to be equal, I figured that if Edspice is a half ounce, you figure that's, there's 29 and a half um, milliliters in an ounce, so roughly 30 milliliters to an ounce, half of that is a half ounce, would be 15. So for the uh, for the boil time, so we could compare with the Etzbitz, I calculated that it basically equals about 15 milliliters uh, worth of fluid, so we could match up. So 15 were in the tea light, 15 were in the bud, uh, 15 went. I didn't do that one. We'll do that one separately. Um, and the Altoids, and we all used an Etzbitz cooker, Snow, uh, Snow Peak 700 with two cups of cold water. For 16 ounces and uh, let's see here we ended up with let's start at the top the uh, baby Altoids was a nine minute um, cook time just barely barely came to a boil um, you've got the uh, Budweiser blue here that uh, did a boil time in seven minutes um, and I didn't calculate how long it burnt after that. Um, basically, worried about a boil time. So, 15 milliliters, seven minutes, you got a boil. So that was, I think, by far the quickest time out of these four here. Um, let's see, tea light with 15 milliliters boiled at 10 and a half minutes, and uh, basically died at 11. So it just had enough juice to just bring this to a boil. Um, the Etzbitz did bring to a boil at nine and a half, so they advertise that this burns at 1400 degrees. Um, it's supposed to burn for 12 to 15 minutes. Like I said, I've never got it past 12, and in fact, this one died not even really a usable flame right at 12. Um, but I did get a boil at nine and a half minutes, which beat the tea light by about a minute to reach a boil. Um, this guy again was nine, so if we arrange these. Seven and a half, well, seven minutes flat for the blue. Uh, then you've got nine minutes for this guy. That's bits at where we go nine and a half and ten and a half for the tea light. So you're sort of gaining. This guy definitely burned a lot hotter. You got a big, bigger flame pattern. Um, you know, keep in mind with the other tests, it was the first one to run out, but 
it was a hotter output. It used all its power right at once and you got a quicker boil time, which is pretty impressive. Uh, the stove itself is a little heavier. One of the reasons I was comparing these guys is if you weigh this full of fuel, 15 milliliters, um, for this test, you weigh that and the fuel, it weighs identical 13 grams to this guy. So really, other than cost, they're pretty much equal. Uh, you got one minute sooner at nine and a half than the ten and a half boil time here. Um, it's pretty comparable. Um, so as far as weight gains, I think the only difference would be ease of accessible for alcohol uh, for the tea light. Um, you'd be able to pick that up at gas stations along through hiking. And then overall, I think cost would probably be higher on the Edspits. And uh, we're going to run that up in a second. Um, I did exclude the caldera out of that boil time. Uh, a, to be fair, it doesn't fit in the Edspits part. And uh, I'm going to be doing this with its own system here. And we'll compare boil times with its own stove and setup. Thanks.